I hate vlogs. And look what I'm doing. Hello. James Robert Hermes here. Um, few things I want to talk about before I show you a bunch of random stuff that I filmed. I need you to rate my videos, favorite my videos, share my videos, subscribe to my channel, and leave comments. I always respond to comments. Even if they're troll comments, I will respond to them. Don't send me friend requests, because I only re accept friend requests from people I know. Uh, Rough ED is me, was uh, posted a video. Um, Don Ventel posted something on Twitter. I hate Twitter, I will never use Twitter. I know, I hate vlogs too, but I'm doing that. But I hate Twitter even more than I hate vlogs. So, no Twitter. Uh, but uh, Don Ventel posted on Twitter to act like what you stereotypically look like. And Rafi D is me posted the question on one of his videos, what does he look like? So I thought, what do I look like? Dark Emporium. Um, I don't think I'm saying his name right. Sorry about that. But uh, he was posting something about um, AdSense. Um, and apparently somebody um, click bombed him. Um, this is the first time I've ever heard of this. And I I'm not going to talk about it too much. The, the Vlog Brothers thing, the Project for Awesome, promoting a charity. Um, I didn't do it last year because of uh, stuff that I won't go into. Um, I sort of did it the year before that, but I made a quick video. Like, I didn't actually film anything, I just kind of put the logo up and talked over it. And this year I think I'm actually going to try and film something. Um, probably next week. Yeah, next week sounds good, because it's coming up pretty fast. And the Project for Awesome is making a video that promotes a charity. Um, I'm of course going to be promoting Arca Hope for Children again. There's a website called Fiverr.com where you can post any weird tasks or things to do for five dollars and I found out about this because um, Yahoo News posted about it so I click on it I check out this website and people are doing weird things I don't know who would pay five dollars for this stuff but I decided I've got my YouTube logos Um, and I need money. I pretty much like how most of my YouTube logos came out, even though I don't use some as much as others. Like, um, Real Vestro, I use a lot, even though that's actually my least favorite one. I really don't like how that one turned out. And I'm not really sure what else I could do with it to make it better. But yeah, that, that's not one of my favorites. Um, James Robert Hermes is my favorite one. There will be a link down in the doobly-doo. And probably right over my face for Fiverr. Where you can order your own YouTube logos for your channel. They'll have your channel name or series or whatever you want on it. And I'll make a logo for it.
you know what my logos look like. You know the work I can do. So, if you want a logo for five dollars, send me a uh, order request on Fiverr. Not on here, but on Fiverr. I noticed on the new YouTube homepage that there's a button that says trending. So you can easily look up trending topics. I clicked on that, and the first thing at the top of the list was a news report about a Mythbusters experiment that went horribly, horribly wrong. Um, somebody posted in the comments of that video, and I tend to agree with it, because this happened at night, and it's supposed to be a Mythbusters experiment that went wrong. What happened was, they were in a shooting range. The myth was to see if other things could it be loaded into a cannon and shoot as well as a cannonball. So they took a cannonball, put that into the cannon for their um, what's it called? Um, I can't think of the word now, but it's the first experiment they do to see how far the actual cannonball is going to uh, shoot before they start putting a bunch of other random stuff into it. But um, the cannonball was supposed to shoot into a bunch of trash cans filled with water and instead it missed its target, went into the nearby town through a couple of houses but this was all being done at night the comment that was in, in that video was the fact that the Mythbusters never film at night there's several times uh, when filming uh, certain myths that they have to uh, film outside that they will hold the experiment off and uh, do it another day if they're losing sunlight. So, th this couldn't have really been a Mythbusters experiment if it happened at nighttime, because they wouldn't have been filming. They would have held off the experiment till the next day. If it happened in the daytime, then maybe. But they're kind of blaming the Mythbusters because it did happen in the town where the Mythbusters do all their filming at. But it just couldn't have been them because it was filmed or because it happened at nighttime. They wouldn't have been filming then. So maybe their equipment was left at the shooting range and this was something that was part of their experiment but it wasn't them doing it like somebody was tampering with their stuff probably somebody who worked at the shooting range because who else would have access to it that's just what I think about it so I'm gonna actually take advantage of that feature look up trending topics and talk about them because I don't know what else to do with these videos. And maybe show you a bunch of uh, more random crap that I film. Eskimo pie is people. Eskimo people. I'm at a Big Lots that just opened like maybe a month or two ago. Yeah, a month. And uh, there's some uh, Transformer Cybertron toys that are in the wrong packaging. <laughs> They're like five years old. I don't know how a new store has five-year-old Transformers. Maybe just these three. Yeah. Undermine. 
Recluse and Backstop. Autobot? Decepticon? Decepticon. Oh, those are uh, key things like uh, TJ likes. Mm -hmm. They're cyber keys. Yeah, cyber keys. Yeah. Oh, there's some more, even oh. smaller ones over here. Drivetrain. Break neck. <laughs> How would you like to break your neck? <laughs> and there's Iron Man behind it for some reason. And then we go over here. G1 Predacon knockoffs. Protectobot knockoffs. Some other knockoff. There's an Optimus Prime knockoff back here that they don't actually have here. But I kind of like to have it because it would make a good Cybertronian version of Optimus Prime with it alt mode. <laughs> Some what looks like Constructicon knockoffs. Lots of Transformers knockoffs. Yeah, more of those uh, cyber key ones. Ah. I'm knocking things over while vlogging. <laughs> At least that's above the tail instead of directly in his. <laughs> <laughs> Shouldn't even be here. Indian werewolf. Unicycle. 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 Dog driving a car. see those around here but it was very loud like just the flapping of its wings I could hear it and it looked like it was carrying a rock in its mouth yeah I really hate vlogs <laughs> <laughs>